surprise a little bit. So Alessandro Vezzoni then uh, just got his rear wheel onto the gravel there. Oof. The minute you put a wheel offline, you're in trouble. And uh, this, how, what happened to Grossman here? There, there was some contact there. Okay, because the car is slowing now, isn't it? Yes. I think it's rear left contact earlier on in the corner. Is that tire deflating? Potentially. Uh, there's uh, Bjorn's partner to the left hand side and you can see how disappointed she is and how disappointed this man will be. His car is in the pit lane. Oh my goodness me. Oh, big shunt, big shunt. That'll be another red flag. So, a number of cars involved in that. Uh, John Boyd, I think Murray Rotlander, and uh, the 212 car of, uh, of uh, John Boyd is the one you can see to the right hand side of your uh, picture. The yeah, other one no is idea how Angelo happened. Negro, I think. So, there is the uh, 251 car of uh, Rob Hodes. Um, following the uh, the car of uh, Thomas O'Roca. Oh, so uh, uh, John Boyd then, as I mentioned, in that uh, 212 car. Uh, pleasingly, uh, uh, good to see that Angelo uh, Negra is out of the uh, car. And uh, the other car that is involved in that is the Murray Rothlander car. It'll be good to see Murray out of the uh, car. Uh, as well, so the safety car has uh, been deployed. <sighs> Again, another one in a straight line. The That's a very dangerous, cabin. very dangerous crash. And Thomas O'Roca was, of course, just well. There was nothing he could do to uh, avoid being <laughs> picked up in that. No. He was minding his own business. Look at the right hand side of your picture at the oh. speed there. No, that's very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. I know we've we've said it lots of times before, Sam, but um, when you're on the grass and the grass is damp, you actually accelerate, don't you? But also, he was very lucky. The car was slightly airborne going over the sausage curb at the apex. Yes. If that car had made good contact with that sausage curb, that, that crash could have been another three times as bad. Well, thankfully, Murray is out of the car and he's uh, perfectly okay. So this crash is now under investigation, as you can imagine. David, such a shame because we were having a good final up till then. Uh, I know the red flag and everything, we put that to the back of our minds. We were enjoying the chess match between Nicholas Nielsen and David Fulminelli. And, and uh, the longer the safety car stays out there, and I think this is going to be a lengthy one, the less racing these fans here at the, at the track and the fans at home are going to be able to see. Less racing. You're right. <sighs> sure you just stand there in bewilderment almost now the incident involving cars number 19